All right, guys, really love this stuff. This is the 3D printing that we've been doing. So we thought we'd give you a bit more of an inside look at that. So this is our 3D printer. Very basic, you might have seen one of these before, but this is the Zortrax M200. A really cool printer, really good quality. And so it's actually printing here. So you can actually see it go round and round, does all these little layers of ABS plastic. So this is the ink, the ABS plastic on the side, effectively the ink. And I'll show you the front of this ring. So this is a speaker ring we're designing and printing for the Toyota. But see, this one's a, a mistake because it's actually lifting on the front here. You can see it's lifted up and it's warped when it's been designed because it's actually got heat coming through it. So we had to change that a little bit. So what we'll do, as you can see here, this is Jason, our head designer. Say hi, Jace. How you going? <laughs> he's actually modifying the design a little bit here. So as you can see, he's cut some stuff out the front. But if you zoom out, Jason, just show them the speaker so they can see what they're looking at. So there you go, that's the whole speaker. We're actually just making it a little bit better the print, less shrinkage, a bit stronger. To make it look perfect, but that gives you an idea where it starts. But that's really the hard part, and it's all in the actual design. So Jason's the man for that. And what you end up doing is getting a result like this. So this is actually one of our almost perfected rings. Make a ring plug and play for customers to actually fit their speakers themselves. So that's copying a factory Toyota one. And we redesigned the different plugs for the tweeter and things like that so they can actually do them themselves. And this is where it all starts. So we actually start here, we design it up, we talk about an idea, Jace draws it up, measures it up. So these simple drawings, very basic stuff. Then he does an actual diagram. And you can see there, this is your sketchbook. So he cuts it out, so we actually cut that out, test in the car just to save time. Then we print a sample. The reason we use green is so we can actually draw on it and modify it. We didn't print the center just to save time. And that was that's how we actually would design something. So these are some different inks, different colors. This is ABS plastic. Um, this one down here is a polycarbonate translucent so that you can actually see through it and absorb light. Some pretty cool different things. You can get high intensity ones, um, so it's got more strength and stuff. But some really cool stuff and that really is the future of design for speakers and you know, the car audio industry. That's some of the stuff we're trying that other people probably haven't seen before, but pretty cool.